Color Science and Forgettable Total Protection. I have four different ones here, or actually three different ones. I have the classic, which is the cult favorite of everyone the glow version which is duh glowy and i also have the flex versions i have both the fair and the medium but before we begin let's go see some swatches mm -hmm. We are gonna start with the original and the glow. On my left side, I will be using the classic and then on my right side, I'm gonna use the glow. I usually apply it right from the bottle to my face. I just feel like it's easier to use, less mess. So as you can see here, this has like a peachy tone to it. When you first apply it, you could definitely tell that it is very light, but the tint is to remove the white cast and eventually the lightness will disappear as you can see here it already disappeared and has sunken to my skin glow time this glow version acts the same way as the classic except that it is more glowy as the name states and also the undertone of this this is also very very moisturizing and i really love using this during the colder months for reference my skin is combo so the tint is definitely noticeable this one has a yellow golden tint and this one started out peachy but then it disappeared now i want to show you how the sunscreen sits underneath foundation i'm going to use my favorite nars light reflecting foundation this is in the shade punjab by the way i totally forgot that my nars punjab is my summer shade so this is a little bit warm so i'm using my favorite tart concealer to combat warmness i am using the shade 29n and this is the perfect neutral shade i really like this concealer this is very creamy and it blends very well and it also sets into like a beautiful satin finish and this is how it looks like with makeup and i'm done now it's time for the color flex i'm gonna apply the fair on this side and the medium on this side This one starts out white and then it changes as you rub it in. This shade is definitely too fair for me. It does uh, darken as you rub it in your skin. But um, to me, this is just heck of pale because if you compare it to my neck, this is just too, too fair. Let's go put on the medium side now. This one, while it can work for me it is too warm with my neck you can see where the color ended and my neck and i have worn this so many times already and then each time i look in the mirror i'm just like oh my gosh this is so warm i am pretty sure in the summertime i can wear this by itself because my whole body will be more tan so these two mixed together is my color if only color science would think about light medium gals like me okay i'm gonna try my best to fix it with the colors on the other side just so you can see what it looks like when both are mixed together right here and right here and right here Now that we have made a light medium shade, compare that to the fair girl. This is way too fair. This is perfect Asian girl skin, okay? All right, let's tan my skin. Apply that right here and then right here where I put bronzers and then mix them up.
and this is the light medium shade that we have created this is the perfect shade i love how this looks it covers up the redness very well as you can see here and the concealer on top just makes everything Ooh. this one is the urban decay quickie this is in the shade 40 nn i really really like this concealer this is on par with my tarte concealer initially i got the shade 40 wy but it is a little bit too warm for me so that's going to be my summer shade but here's me remembering the concealer has its own brush so yeah i'm using it now it actually works very well this is how it looks like compared to before and after normally like you do your makeup of course you are going to set your face this is definitely a makeup type of a sunscreen so you take your favorite powder and then you dab your oily parts like for me it's the t-zone and then of course i'm gonna set my under eye i use the fair shade of the charlotte tilbury airbrush powder i love that and then i'm gonna use the medium for the other parts of my face slightly and there you go all set here's the final look i have all of my makeup on and can you just believe that this base makeup is a sunscreen i just love using this as my daily makeup it's just so quick it's like a moisturizer foundation and it just covers my redness and it's just so amazing so one thing i will note is that these are very different than the classic and the glow so those two are definitely just you know like a regular sunblock but these are just i think these these should be labeled as like a foundation or like a tinted moisturizer or you could call this like a CC cream these are just in that range of products I love how these are a 50 SPF plus 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 because that is definitely what we need and if you are applying sunblock in general you do have to use the two finger rule so basically for me i just go and then and then that is two fingers and it will definitely protect you from the sun rays and i noticed this to be true because the moment that i started doing that i noticed that my blemishes and dark spots just went away over time or lessened over time and my face just looks brighter in general if you are a true medium and a true fair one of these will work for you perfectly but if you are my skin tone definitely you should get both of these and then mix them together i know that sounds expensive and it probably is expensive and i think it really is expensive because but if you love your skin and want to protect it from the sun and look covered and look completely snatched, then you will love this. All right, it's your turn. Let's talk. Have you tried Color Science? Which of the many products that they have do you have? And what is your ultimate favorite and if you have not tried this before which of these four that you saw today are you most interested in let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up and if you're looking for more videos on my channel check out this video right here this video is all about the urban decay quickie like you saw me use today it is amazing i will see you there and don't forget have a beautiful and a wonderful 